Leaving your job to go self-employed? Hey everyone, Adam Bergman here, tax attorney and founder of IRA Financial. In today's video, are you leaving your job and wanna maybe become self-employed? Maybe you wanna be part of the gig economy? Maybe you wanna be a consultant, 1099? What are your options? So the interesting thing about being self-employed other than having freedom, controlling your work-life balance, is you actually get to save a lot more than you think. The solo 401k, which is the best retirement plan for the self-employed, allows you to put away a lot more money than a regular IRA or SEP IRA, or even an employer 401k. Here's why. You get to do the same employee deferrals of 22,500 if you're under 50, or 30K if you're over 50, but you also get a profit sharing component of allowing you to do 20% of your net schedule C, or 25% of your W-2, up to a combined amount of 66,000 if you're under 50, or 73,500 if you're over 50. So until you work at Tesla or Apple and you make 100K, generally you're put in and you're under 50 years old, you'll, you'll max out and put the 22.5. Maybe your employer will give you a 4% match. Okay, so maybe another four or five grand. But if you had a solo K and you made 100K, you can do 22.5 plus either 20% if you were a sole proprietor or single member LLC of the 100K, or if you were a W2S Corp or C Corp, you can do 25% of your 100K, giving you a lot more money. Now, on top of that, the solo 401K has something called a mega backdoor Roth option, which if you're a Roth lover like I am, you can go dollar for dollar, 66 or 73.5 if you're over 50, all in Roth. Whereas most employers will not offer the mega backdoor because of very complex ERISA rules. So not only are you gonna get freedom, you're gonna to get to do what you want, work-life balance, maybe work at home, you're gonna get a super, super duper opportunity to take advantage of the solo K. You can also then do a Roth IRA on top of your solo K contributions, max out the Roth 6,500 or 7,500 if you're over 50, max out hopefully your solo K 66K or 73.5, but you don't have to max out, right? You can put in a dollar, you can put in $5,000, you have, the option to do what you want, but being self-employed gives you so much of a powerful retirement option, way more robust and powerful than if you worked at a large Fortune 500 company because of the enormous power of the solo 401k. So if you are leaving your job for this to be part of the gig economy or take your life into your own hands, congratulations. But you should know, not only do you get healthcare, but you have the opportunity of taking advantage of the most, most powerful retirement plan for the self-employed, the solo 401k. I should know I wrote two books on the solo K. I would love to be self-employed, but I love my team. Uh, and so I can't be self-employed, but hey, maybe one day. Otherwise, um, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you wanna learn more about the powers of the solo K, call us. We have an amazing team of tax professionals that would answer, and love to answer any of your questions. You can email us, you can contact us, contact us by chat. You can leave a comment or question on this video or any other video on our channel. And uh, they come to me every day. I do my best to get back to everyone uh, as soon as possible. Otherwise, appreciate you hanging out with me today. And I look forward to seeing everyone again soon on my next video. Take care.